Today we ask, can we trap minnows in body armor? Well, let's find out. Howdy y'all. Um, today we'll be doing some minnow trapping or what we attempted minnow trapping. And I got professional crowded trappers with me today. And we're gonna try to be using body armors cause that's pretty much all I got. So let's get in the video. We're cutting out the traps right now. We got, we're setting up a bunch of traps and we got dog food here and we're just getting it all kinds of ready. Yeah. All right, Bo, you can show them what we got. So first we have these two, just we cut a hole in the bottom and we took the lid off and then same thing on this one. And then we cut the bottom off of these and just tied them together. Just hoping we catch one like that, put some dog food in there. And then we have this one too. Yep, one of these one of these we're gonna use for crowded trapping. This one's for minnows. I think that I think one of these two will be for crowded trapping. Yeah. Me too. Gosh. What? So high. Can you walk It's pretty high. Yeah. All right, we're we're going to that other side where the boat is. Yeah, I know. Yeah. Yep, yep. You got it? He's got a minnow. Right, I'll try to catch that other one. Okay, yeah, take that. Oh, we forgot a bucket. Oh, I had my finger in the way. Well, we'll have to do it later. Here's a minnow. We got a minnow. Got the other one. You got another one? Yep. There we go. All right, for, okay, so well, here's the plan. For all the things that we catch by the end of the video, we're gonna put them all in the bucket so we can show them all off to you guys. Yeah. Make sure you don't tear that. And um, and we'll just throw these back. Ba-doop. And so we're gonna catch them, all, put them all in a bucket, and then we'll go out there with these traps or with these nets and try to get some more. And we'll just put them all in a bucket and show all the things we got. And this is where we decide to put the bigger trap. Yeah, does that mean? Oh crap. It might be a rock or something. A stick. There we go. You got it to sink? Yep. That's good enough, I say. Alright, we set this one up here. We made a bunch of we saw a bunch of minnows walking in. We didn't get, we didn't show you. But we might be able to see some up here. There's a bunch of minnows. Some minnows. There you go. There's some minnows, guys. Here. I don't know if you'll be able to see you're gonna be able to see them or not. But I took a closer look. They're not minnows, they're actually bluegill. Like little bluegill. I don't think you can see them though. No frog again? <laughs> All right, here's our backyard pond. Here's our backyard pond. We're gonna put it in the middle of it, I think. We were, they were catching uh, baby crawdads out of it earlier today, so yeah. let's see if we can get anything out of it. Right here, yeah, it's deep enough it sinks all the way down. You're, don't get your leg in the water. Mm. Boone, back your head up, dude. Did you get it in there? No. Yeah. What'd you get? I got two baby crawdads from right here. Uh-oh. Yeah, he just scooped two baby crawdads up. Just right out of here. Now we're gonna have to go get more dog food so we can trap them. I got a whole bunch more. Look, look. Holy cow. Yeah, there's a bunch more than I thought. There's our ton. Look, I, I have some right here on the rim. Are we gonna get a bucket? What should we do with them? Should we get oh, a bucket? I, I get think they'll die if we put them in a bucket. I, I think we should go put them in the pond. Letting the crawdads go wide, Boone's barking at them. Got the dog over there. There was a frog over here a while ago. There was. You got your little Tyson? Hmm? Yeah, I threw him in the water. I didn't put him down. But... Not a couple of times. But well, we're going to set the trap right here. I'm like yelling right now. And there goes half the dog food. This rock should keep you down if it stays balanced, but it's, it's about to fall over already. 
we just woke up. Um, Bo was able to stay another night and his brother Jason, but he's an inside rocker right now. And here's our first trap we set. We're gonna check it. We might actually have something in it. Things come out of this trap really easy though. You can't tell it's all that dog food. Yes, that's a lot of dog food. Uh, oh wait, we might have something. Yeah, never mind, we don't. I don't see anything. I don't think we Let's have don't anything. All right, you checking the second trap. Holy cow, all the water came out. So if we had a minute, it's out of there. We got a little snail. Hmm. Nothing more. Uh, I think I think these trash these traps might be trash. No, no, no. We didn't get nothing. No. Ooh. Man, the I think that we made some bad traps. Yeah, so, uh, this is our last body armor trap. Body armor traps. Trash. Yep. And we're pulling up the green one now. We put way too much dog food in there. Trapping's not going very well, guys. Just throw back down in there. It'll be fine. I'm gonna throw it out there deeper. You're gonna throw it out there deeper? Make sure you get the, you keep the rope with you. How deep should I throw it? It's decently deep right there. That works. Now just bring the rope to the shore and it'll be fine. Thank you. So if you didn't know, trapping in one of these things is completely impossible. I don't recommend doing it. Goodbye.